Yair Lapid is an Israeli politician and former journalist serving as chairman of the Yesh Atid party and opposition leader in the Knesset. He served as Minister of Finance from 2013 to 2014. Before entering politics in 2012, Lapid was an author, TV presenter and news anchor. The centrist Yesh Atid party, which he founded, became the second largest party in the Knesset by winning 19 seats in its first legislative election in 2013. The greater-than-anticipated results contributed to Lapid's reputation as a leading centrist in March 2013. Following his coalition agreement with Likud, Lapid was appointed to be Minister of Finance and member of the Security Cabinet. In 2013, Lapid ranked first on the list of the most influential Jews in the world by the Jerusalem Post. He was also recognized in 2013 as one of the leading foreign policy global thinkers and ranked as one of Time magazine's 100 most influential people in the world. On 17 May 2020, Lapard became the leader of the opposition. After the 35th government of Israel was sworn in, Lapard serves on the Knesset Foreign Affairs and Defense Committee and the Subcommittee on Intelligence and the Security Services. On 5 May 2021, Lapard was entrusted with the second mandate to form a new government. After the incumbent Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu failed to do so with the first mandate, Lapard was born in Tel Aviv. His father was journalist and politician Yosef Tommy Lapard, who served as Justice Minister, and his mother is novelist and playwright Shulamit Lapard. He has a sister, Merav, who is a clinical psychologist. Another sister, Mitchell, died in a car accident in 1984. Both of his grandmothers were alive when his parents moved to Israel. His great-grandmother Hermione Lampal was arrested in Serbia and sent to Auschwitz, where she was murdered in a gas chamber. Lappard grew up in Tel Aviv and London. His childhood home in Tel Aviv was in the Yad Aliyahu neighborhood, in a residential building known as the Journalist's Residence. As several prominent journalists lived there, he attended high school at the Hertlier Hebrew Gymnasium, but struggled with learning disabilities and dropped out without earning a Bagrut certificate. He began his mandatory military service in the Israel Defense Forces in the 500th Brigade of the Armored Corps. During the 1982 Lebanon War, Lapid suffered an asthma attack after inhaling dust kicked up by a helicopter and was pulled from the corps. He then served as a military correspondent for the IDF's weekly newspaper, Bamahane. After completing his military service, he began working as a reporter for Mariv and published poetry in literary journals. He also had a career as an amateur boxer. In the mid-1980s, Lappard married Tamar Friedman. They later divorced, and he moved to Los Angeles, where he worked in the television industry. He later returned to Israel, where he resumed his journalism career. He is married to journalist Lehi Lappard, and lives in the Ramat Aviv Gimel neighborhood of Tel Aviv. He and his wife have two children, and he has another son, Yov. From his first marriage, he attends the Daniels Centers for Progressive Judaism, a reform synagogue in Tel Aviv. In 1988, at age 25, Lappard was appointed editor of Yedioth Tel Aviv, a local newspaper published by the Yedioth Aronith Group. In 1991, he began writing a weekly column in a nationwide newspaper's weekend supplement, first for Mariv, and later for its competitor, Yedioth Aronith. His column's name, Where's the Money? Quote, became his political slogan decades later. In 1994, Lappert started on TV, hosting the leading Friday evening talk show on Israel TV's Channel 1. That same year, he had an acting role in an Israeli film, Song of the Siren. He next hosted a talk show on TV's Channel 3. From 1999 to 2012, Lappert hosted a current affairs talk show on Channel 2. From 1989 to 2010, Lappard wrote and published several books, spanning a variety of genres. His first was a thriller, of which he has published three more. The others include two children's books, two novels, and a collection of his newspaper columns. In addition, he wrote a drama series, War Room, that aired on Channel 2 in 2004. In January 2008, Lappard was the host of Ulpam Shishi. Channel 2's Friday Night News magazine. That year, the Camry Theatre performed his first play, The Right Age for Love. In September 2013, 
The Israeli edition of Forbes magazine estimated Lapid's net worth at 22 million shekels. On 8 January 2012 Lapid announced that he would be leaving journalism in order to enter politics. On 30 April he formally registered his party. Yeesh did. The move was timed to coincide with the general expectation in Israel for early elections to be held in the early fall of 2012, a few days after Yeish Atid's registration. In a surprise move, Benjamin Netanyahu formed a national unity government. It was then thought that Lapard's party would have to wait until late 2013 before it could 